Welcome to the video. My name is Alexi and on this channel I cover all things Azure. And today I'm revealing you why Azure is such a great career choice. So if you're interested in this topic, stick around since I'm going to cover some very interesting points that you might not be aware of. Firstly, the whole cloud computing industry is growing at very rapid pace. Since the cloud computing stands at the forefront of the digital transformation, that is happening all around us. Azure, Microsoft's cloud, is not just a player on this industry, it's a key driver. According to industry experts, cloud computing has been on an upward trend for years and shows no signs of slowing down. The adaptation of cloud solutions across various sectors, from small businesses to multinational corporations, is accelerating all the time. Globally, Azure is positioned as one of the leading cloud platforms, and it is trusted by many organizations for its robustness, scalability, and extensive service offerings. In response to this demand, Microsoft has been constantly expanding its data centers worldwide to ensure the low latency access to cloud resources. So, when you consider career in Azure, you are not just entering a growing industry, you are stepping into a huge world of technology that is rapidly and dynamically expanding all the time. Your skills in Azure can make huge impact on businesses, making you a very valuable asset in today's digital age. This gets us into our second point, which is that there is a huge demand for Azure professionals. The digital transformation era driven by cloud computing has caused a huge surge in demand for professionals in this field, and Azure stands at the forefront of this demand. According to job market statistics, the demand for Azure professionals has been on an exponential rise. Azure-related job postings have surged since companies are all the time looking for new professionals who can harness the potential of Azure. Azure's selection of services spans across infrastructure, software development, machine learning, AI, data, analytics, and many more. This diversity means that Azure professionals can specialize in various areas, catering to different specialized needs of different industries and organizations. The versatility of Azure professionals is a key reason why their demand is not limited to a particular industry or region. From healthcare to finance, from manufacturing to retail, Azure is transforming businesses in every sector. And as a result, Azure professionals have a vast variety of opportunities to explore. Another factor contributing to this demand is the ongoing wave of cloud migration. Many companies are migrating their workflows from on-premises to cloud, and this migration requires a skilled workforce to ensure that everything goes smoothly. So, choosing a career in Azure means that your skills will be in very high demand and your expertise will be sought after by organizations of all sizes and industries. And since the demand for Azure expertise is so high, companies have to fight over these valuable professionals. And this gets us into our third point, which are the high salaries in the Azure profession. The world of technology is already well known for its competitive salaries, but Azure professionals tend to find themselves at the top of the earnings pyramid. Now let's check out few popular Azure job titles, so you would get an idea what you would be expecting to earn in these positions. According to Glassdoor, Azure engineers tend to have an annual pay of around $140,000, and that is already some serious money. Also, the very low end of the range is almost $100,000, which is already a pretty solid salary to have. And this gets even better. Now, let's check out how much Azure architects tend to make. The average pay for an Azure architect is around $240,000, with the low end of the range starting from $150,000 and going up almost to $400,000. I hope this proves to you that there is some serious money to be made in Azure. And now I will prove to you that working in Azure ecosystem gives you an extra edge in the salary game compared to your peers working in other ecosystems. For example, let's check out the average annual pay for a data engineer, which is around $115,000. And now let's add word Azure to our search and we can see that the now the average annual salary jumps into almost $140,000. So on average, working in Azure ecosystem gives you over $20,000 extra annually. Beyond salaries, many companies offer competitive benefit packages to attract and retain Azure professionals. These benefits often include bonuses, stock options, health insurances, and paid time off 
enhancing the overall compensation package. So Azure is a great choice for those seeking rewarding and well-compensated career in technology. You might think that achieving all these great things you would have to grind a degree from some top-tier university, but that is not the case at all. In fact, you don't need any formal degrees to land your dream job in Azure ecosystem. While I think traditional education has its merits, but in the tech industry, skills and practical knowledge often hold more weight than formal degrees. I personally have a master's degree, and in my opinion, it has given me many valuable skills to use in my career. But at the same time, I have a colleague who is making big money and only has a high school diploma and he is under 30 years old. This makes me sometimes think, why did I do six years in university? And this gets us to our fifth point. You can learn basically everything about Azure for free online. The World Wide Web has made education accessible and available to everybody with an internet connection. And Azure is no exception to this rule. First, we have Microsoft's official documentation and their study plans for their many different certification exams that you can use as a stepping stone to Azure ecosystem. Also, Microsoft is kind enough to provide a free trial to Azure and offer many Azure services for free for 12 months, which enables gaining that valuable hands-on experience with Azure. In addition, there are a lot of community forums and blog posts where Azure professionals share their knowledge, provide insights, and solve common problems with Azure. Plus, they often encourage interaction and questions. For more visual learners, there are countless video tutorials available on platforms such as YouTube, where Azure professionals share their expertise and best practices to everybody for free. And this channel that you're currently watching happens to be one of them, where I provide that zero-cost Azure knowledge to you. For example, if you are interested in becoming an Azure Data Engineer, I would highly recommend to check out my introduction video to Azure Data Factory that is the cornerstone of building data pipelines in Azure. Now I thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel for more Azure content. See you in the next video.